The tools I'm going to talk about today are my round microblading tattoo needles, specifically the R3, which is three needles bunched together, and the R5, which is five needles bunched together. I use these needles on any animals with feathers or fur. They work great for putting down a base layer, and while still very flexible, they provide a soft, natural look for rendering fur. They work great for wavy and curly hair, as well as straight. The direction and way you draw your hair in your portrait is super important when trying to make something look realistic. You can continue to go over and layer areas that need to be wider and when working on scratchboard I always recommend using a light touch and then gradually build up your brighter areas. The R5 is going to provide a soft fur texture while the R3 will have slightly stronger line marks. For really white areas I do occasionally use an R7 or R21. Both are much stiffer and are better when used after the base layer is already down. Click the like button and let me know in the comments below if you found this video helpful.